Rather than trees, these giraffes eat specially prepared branches, which are set at the perfect height for them to reach. This kangaroo seems to spend all her time eating and drinking. The warthog enjoys his waterlogged habitat. Nearby, the warty pigs also seem to enjoy a bit of a swamp. They're slightly less damp than the warthogs. as feeding time approaches. as food is given out. <laughs> Unfortunately, one meerkat seems to miss out. Meerkats are omnivores, so they eat a mixture of fruit, vegetables and meat. Today's special is oranges. With a side order of dead mouse. Panda lives alone, which is just the way he likes it, and he'll never get bored. Constantly walking, the emu wanders around its enclosure.
quiet moment, the emu stands still to examine the ground. The flamingos love to splash around in the water. Their characteristic pink colour comes from the beta carotene in the shrimp which they eat. Some flamingos lose their vivid colour when living in captivity. This often happens when their diet has been changed. As you can see, the flamingos at Flamingoland are all very firmly pink. These penguins appear to be watching over the others in some kind of leadership team. The penguins on the ground are grooming themselves to ensure they look their best. This penguin floats on the surface of the water. He is face down because in the wild he would be hunting for fish to eat. In the zoo, his food comes in a bucket at five o'clock. It's not going to change generations of hunting instincts though. He rejoins his friends on the top of Penguin Rock where he reports that he found no fish. A second swimmer, at first glance, he also appeared to be hunting. As time goes on, it becomes apparent that he has a different reason for getting wet. He just loves a good swim. He has now been underwater for so long that we lose sight of him. <laughs> 